Gordon, what did we find today? Uh, here we have a whole bunch of slippery jacks, uh, which are Swillis. It's a genus of bolete that is known for their very sort of slippery tops. Uh, it's been a couple days since it's rained, so the tops aren't too slippery, but they're these sort of beautiful coppery, you know, brown color, uh, beautiful or uh, yellow orangey pore surface. Stains slightly brown uh, when you when you bruise it. Um, these Swillis surulescens usually fruit early winter, and so it's really unusual to see them here in spring. Uh, but they're mycorrhizal with a fir tree behind us, and they've just been all all around this tree. Um, they're actually a pretty decent edible mushroom. Um, I definitely like them when they're fresh. Uh, they will stain sort of erratically blue around the base here, um, but it's not not every mushroom and not every time. But uh, still, sort of fun to watch them watch them stain a little bit as you as you cut them up. Uh, they do make a, a good edible mushroom, as I mentioned, uh, but they're not texturally comparable with a king bully. They're a little bit more slippery um, because that when you cook them, I like to cook them kind of low and slow really let uh, some of the polysaccharides and the other stuff cook out for a while and uh, and then at the end you add some fat and brown them up and get them nice and crispy uh, but that is that's a good way to sort of go about cooking them so um, you can see here this one's now starting to to stain a little bit kind of green blue which is cool looking so uh, I'm super excited that we found a whole basket of these um, I think we're probably gonna dry some out and probably eat some fresh uh, it's definitely a treat this time of year to find these in April. So I'm excited.